Hello everyone, Mike Levin at the Flying Point Digital Office, and I thought the follow-up to that last video would also be of interest. So I am going to delete that all the tweets to function and turn this back into tweets. We know that's working, so now I quit out of Vim. And remember, I'm actually using Vim right on that little virtual machine that's on my desktop here. We'll be teaching you how to do all this natively on your own machine for better stability and performance reasons, but I figure I'll do a git push right here from the uh, from Levinix. So we are already in a git repository, and if I type git status, it will tell me what's changed. Well, of course, I've modified functions.py, and then I do git commit hyphen am, it's probably going to kick back an error because this is the first time I'm doing it on this machine and we got to set my name and email address, but uh, switched tweets function to requests library. Yeah, so this is what happens in Git when you try and uh, do your first commit on a brand new machine. So I do git config hyphen hyphen global user dot email within at gmail.com in case you need to reach me. Git config global user dot name Mike within. Now when I up arrow back to my commit. It will take one file changed, three insertions. Now I do a git push. And this, by the way, is how you contribute back on the Pipulate project. And I expect everyone who's been following along to start doing this. And you type in your username, so you have to get yourself set up. And your password. And there, I just pushed it back up. And if I go back into the, uh, the browser now, and I open a new tab, Hop on over to GitHub. The entire project now, it, because it was pushed by me, it was, I believe, all automatically accepted and wrapped in. Your submits I'll have to review, but uh, let's see. Functions.py switched functions to request library, and I could drill in and see the changes right there. It's that easy. Uh, anybody who's been on the fence regarding GitHub, or Git itself, or uh, Python, or any of the other many awesome technologies at play right here, even Vim. Uh, I believe I'm giving you a clear way. Uh, you can jump right on the bandwagon, start practicing writing functions, and if you get it working, send it on up to GitHub and I'll take a look. And you might have pushed forward the very Pipulate project itself and get in on the uh, ground floor of what I am hoping and am working to make a uh, new popular project in GitHub for learners and for social media and SEO professionals. So thanks for joining me. Hope to talk to you soon. And don't forget to subscribe.